Qualitative research methods The theories and techniques associated with the naturalistic paradigm and qualitative research methods have become accepted enough to engender a political, ideological, and even economic backlash. Despite recent efforts to deny the value of qualitative work, it continues to pervade modern sociological research production. Library and Information Science LIS research makes substantial use of this approach to address complex questions, such as those associated with human information interaction. Underlying principles of naturalistic work in virtually every area of LIS research, from system design to user education evaluation, the series of factors that finally lead a user to an interaction with some part of an information system is increasingly complex. Naturalistic work seeks out all aspects of that complexity on the grounds that they are essential to understanding the behavior of which they are a part. Critical realism approach provides additional insights positing that both the physical and conceptual aka material and ideational components of reality are essential to understanding and, eventually, improving the human condition. Naturalism as a research paradigm Naturalism is an approach that posits reality as holistic, based in the perceptions of individuals and communities, and continually changing research goal centers on understanding, discovering, and explaining. Naturalism in LIS Research The naturalistic paradigm only recently has been accepted in the applied or professional schools. Resultant theories such as Mellon's Library Anxiety and Major Studies have opened the doors for qualitative working LIS to such an extent that the critical focus is on the quality rather than the method of these studies. As has always been the case with quantitative works. Brenda Durbin, an exemplary wellspring of literally hundreds of qualitatively based studies in information seeking, is her extensive work, her sense making approach to understanding communication, decision making, and information seeking behaviors, provides a sound theoretical basis for a great deal of LIS research. In LIS, qualitative research is usually most useful when the information interactions, concerns are so new, so complex, or so unexplored that researchers are working to understand the cognitive, affective, and behavioral aspects of the phenomenon. Role of Mixed or Multi-Method Research A mixed methods or multi-methods approach, in some cases, provides an accessory array of data posits as a false dichotomy the absolute forced choice of either qualitative or quantitative methods. Ethical concerns As in any research involving human beings, a number of ethical concerns demand careful attention. Why are ethical considerations important for qualitative research? to keep the balance between the potential risks of research and the likely benefits of the research. Here are some of the ethical concerns. Participant confidentiality, identifiable information about individuals collected during the process of research will not be disclosed and that the identity of research participants will be protected. Harmless involvement. This issue refers to any harm that might ensue as a result of simply participating in the study. Data gathering techniques. The act of gathering data for a qualitative study is an evolving process rooted in ongoing analysis. It involves more than obtaining discrete units of information. Here are some data gathering techniques, sampling observation interview documents, like questionnaires, diaries, journals, papers, and more. Data Analysis Tools and Methods To Principles of Qualitative Data Analysis First, analysis is an ongoing process that feeds back into the research design right up to the last moment of data gathering. Second, whatever theory, model, or working hypothesis eventually develops must grow naturally from the data analysis rather than standing to the side as an a priori statement. Discourse Analysis Gauge the efficacy of linguistic exchanges aimed at accomplishing particular objectives. Content Analysis Coding Data 
types of coding. Moving from codes to theory, after all the data are finally coded, analysis gradually reveals a framework of patterns and contrasts from which, in some cases, theory can be developed. Data can be organized by 1. Categories i.e., their basic properties 2. Themes i.e., their broad threads of overarching meaning 3. Concepts i.e., explanations Ensuring coding integrity During coding, three techniques help ensure the integrity of the work. First, the acceptable reliability level must be established prior to test coding and met regularly before final coding. Second, Face validity i.e., the correspondence between investigators' definitions of concepts and their definitions of the categories that measured them is necessary but far from sufficient. Finally, in some situations, other sources can be used to confirm inferences from data, codes, and categories. Developing Grounded Theory The Grounded Theory approach, while not the only theoretical option, stands out as central to the naturalistic paradigm because it develops models, hypotheses, and theory directly and primarily from the data without reference to pre-existing concepts or theories. Presentation of findings There are five points specific to the presentation of qualitative research findings that bear mention. First, in almost any forum it may be necessary to explain the concepts behind naturalistic methods. Second, qualitative research requires great detail and explication of both data gathering and data analysis, as does sound quantitative research, with care taken to recognize that the quality controls must be adjusted to context. Third, one ethic of particular value to qualitative research requires the researcher to make some return to the community. Fourth, in almost every case, researchers must make active, careful decisions about giving voice to the participants. Finally, if research is simply to help us understand the world, then the act of scholars publishing solely for other scholars in the same field makes a modest contribution to that goal. Thank you for watching.